Hey, what's up guys? My name's Ethan. Welcome back to another episode of Skyrim Special Edition. Now, <laughs> I did say guys, this is the video where we're going to be doing the pirate build again. <laughs> I'm so sorry guys, I lied. We're not doing the pirate build. We're carrying on with the thieves build for a little bit longer. Now, when I say a little bit longer, I'm literally talking about one or two, maybe pushing three videos worth, but that is it. I probably shouldn't say that because I'm probably uh, probably gonna <laughs> after that say that we're carrying on. But no, hopefully this is the last few videos we're gonna be doing on the pirate build because this is with my thought process. I thought, well, we might as well do another video and uh, finish every or, or as much things in Riften as possible. Um, so then we don't really have to come back to it because what's the point? Like going there and then kind of leaving it half. Half finished, you know. Anyway, today will actually be an interesting video because we're going to be coming up, uh, getting, oh no, becoming the Thane in, oh, there's a bear down there. We're going to be becoming the Thane, no, the bunny, don't kill the bunny. We're going to be becoming the Thane of Riften and we're also. <laughs> We're also um, going to do an interesting quest. Which you guys, oh no, the bunny's dead. Um, an interesting quest. Um, that's all I'm going to say. I don't really want to give anything away. It's not. It's not super special or anything. Well, it's a cool quest. Anyway, I'll see you guys at Riften. All right, guys. I am here, and we're just waiting for the gel to come out. There we go, everyone's kind of loaded in now. This guy's still a bit buggy. Keeps getting his sword out in here. Right. What can I do for you? Um, the crag slain, the crag slain operation has been stopped. Well done. Your continued efforts have been of great benefit to the people of Riften. Allow me to present you with this compensation for your selfless efforts. Uh, is there anything I can help Riften with? Ah, there you are. I was wondering when you'd visit us again. I've been informed by my steward that you've made quite an impression in the Rift. Several of our citizens have expressed their admiration. Regarding what, my lady? Much like Miol, you've become champion of our hold, helping people with their difficulties and providing assistance for their needs. As the Jarl of Riften, I feel it's my duty to honour your selfless behaviour by honouring you with the title Thane of Riften. I would be honoured to accept. Before I can present you with the title, there's but a single requirement you must fulfill. A Thane of Riften is expected to maintain permanent residence within the city walls. My steward has such a home available to you for purchase. I think you'll find the accommodations to be most pleasing. When the house is yours, return to me and I will present you the title. Good journey to you. All right, so I have to purchase the house from this lady Welcome right to here. Miss Vale Keep. I'm Jarl Lit. As Riften steward, I'm afraid I can provide uh, I'd like to purchase assistance. a house in the city, Let's which is 8,000 gold. Ooh, 8,000. Splendid! There's a house available right now. On second thought, perhaps I'll wait a bit longer to decide. Shall I do it, guys? Very well. Just let me know when you're ready to purchase the house. Eight grand. It makes us become the Thane, so we might, we might as well. Let's do it. The house I mentioned earlier is still available if you want to buy it. Sure, I'll take it. Wonderful. Here is the key to your new home. But before we do that, I'd like to decorate my home. I'll be glad to help you. There are many ways to improve your home, provided you have the coin. And of course, don't forget to consult your home decorating guide for descriptions of the decorations you can buy. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Now, what would you like to purchase? Right, give me a bedroom furnishing, Very 600 well. gold. Is there anything else you'd like to purchase? Uh, give me a kitchen. Well. Is there anything or else kitchen like furnishings. Purchase? Give me an alchemy laboratory. Well. Is there anything else you'd like to purchase? Give me an enchanting laboratory. Very well. Is there anything else you'd like to purchase? Give me a garden. Very well. 
Is there anything else you'd like to purchase? Give me a porch. Very well. Is there anything else you'd like to purchase? Replace my enchanting lab with a child's room. Nah, let's not do that. Never mind, I don't want to purchase any decorations right now. As you wish. Speak to me again if you decide to purchase some decorations for your home. You're welcome in Riften, as long as you continue to obey our laws. You're someone who can get things done. I like that. Um, I've purchased Honeyside. Then allow me to officially welcome you to Riften. You'll make a fine addition to our city. All that remains now is to bestow the title upon you. Thank you. I should be the one thanking you. You've solved more problems in the short time you've been here than anyone in my court has their entire careers. You've been a beacon of hope. Well, that puts them all to shame, doesn't it? They probably hate me now. Oh, here's Maven. Never forget it. Therefore, by my authority as Jarl, I pronounce you Thane of Riften and award you all the benefits befitting your station. Congratulations. Okay, I was expecting a little bit more, but that's okay. I'm now Thane. Good journey to you. Right, Maven's here. Let's see if I can... I presume you're bothering me for a good reason. Maybe I can say something what to her. What in the name of oblivion do you want? <laughs> Nothing. All right, let's go have a look at Honey's, uh, Honeyside, I think it's called. There's a thief, guys. You're a good friend of me. That means something. He's just gone inside. He's trying to steal things. I'm just going to kill him real quick. No more! I yield! I yield! <laughs> oh, please. Oh, his head nearly landed in the basket. That would have been awesome if it did. <laughs> You all right there, dude? Did you get Did you get hurt? Are you all good? Have you met Balam? I'm his apprentice. He's teaching me all about being a blacksmith. I used to live at the orphanage here in Richmond. Oh. Grillard said my ma and my da left me there when I was a baby. They didn't want to. Oh, that's a shame. All right, guys. So after about a minute or two searching, I finally found my house, uh, Honeyside here. And I'll open it up in a second. It's a shame, I wish the game would have given you like one of these houses here. That would have been quite nice, because they're a lot roomier. Anyway, Honeyside's kind of down here, tucked out the way uh, by the docks. So let's open it up with my key. Let's have a look inside. Here we are, so I guess this is the porch that we purchased, or the porch furnishings. Here's my uh, house car, I think. The Jarl has appointed me to be your house car. It's an honour to serve you. I'm a Thane. What does that mean? The Jarl has recognised you as a person of great importance in the hold. A hero. The title of Thane is an honour, a gift for your service. Guards will know to look the other way. If you tell them who you are. What does a house call do? As my thane, I'm sworn to your service. I'll guard you and all you own with my life. And I can ask her to be a follower, but I think I'm and just going to leave her one. here. You just knocked all these drinks over, what really. Do you need, my thane? Just, do, do, do you mind? You just kicked them all as I walked in. Maybe if she was drinking them, she kind of like kicked them out of the way as I walked in. <laughs> right, be quiet. So this is uh, it's quite nice, got a bedroom here, got a, not, not much up here is there? Alright, we can eat at that table, we got downstairs, we have some recipes, I'll read these, there we go, nice, another recipe there. Ooh. Okay, enchanting laboratory, okay this is actually way better than the child's bedroom because I've actually seen what that looks like. Yeah, you got lots of armor stands and stuff now. That's that's good. So the child bedroom actually enables you to adopt a child and have them in here. But I'm just gonna adopt them and have them all come into my big house, uh, half the half fire house. So I don't really need anyone sleeping here. Uh, this is my house, Carl's room. 
and I think we actually have our own docks and our own boat if we go out this door just here. All right, here we are in oh on the on our balcony. There's some table and chairs outside. What's really neat is that you don't actually have to pay for this, but with the house you get your own little docks and fishing boat. How cool is that? So we have our own fishing boat now. Super cool. Here's the docks, here's the house. I doubt I'll use it. I just had to buy it to become the Thane, which is a little bit strange that you have to spend 8,000 uh, gold to become the Thane after everything I've done. It's pretty crazy. Anyway, I believe there's someone we need to talk to in the B and Bar to send us on a quest. Now, I'm not entirely sure, but I think this quest is, uh, when, when we're doing it, we're actually, we're actually going against the Maven, and um, we're basically robbing Maven, I think. Let me talk to the guy. Alright, so what I was saying was, I think we actually robbed Maven, steal her horse or something. Let me check, so is this the, the bee and the barb? It is. Let's go inside. The coin, you've come to the right place. Pull up a seat. A fine day to you, friend. May you die with a sword in your hand. I've never seen me all this upset about anything. The city really gets to her. I think we need to speak to this guy here. Looking for work? I need someone to deliver a message to Sibby Blackbriar. Uh, what sort of message? Ah, well, I recently approached Sibby Blackbriar about buying Frost, one of the finest. Oh, okay, so it's Sibby Blackbriar, not. He agreed to sell. Not Maven. I paid Sibby half the cost of Frost up front, but before he could deliver, Maven had him locked up. Sibby believes this exempts him from our deal. It does not. Okay, so we are going to get Maven Sibby for me. Then I want you to bring me Frost and the lineage papers that prove the horse's worth. Sounds easy enough. Good man. You won't regret it. Head to the Ripton jail and talk to Sibby. Get him to tell you where Frost and his lineage papers are and bring them to me outside Ripton. You'll be well paid for your time. Alright. Why is Sibby in jail? No idea. But whatever he did, it must have angered Maven. No guard would lock up a Blackbriar without the old lady's permission. Uh, why don't you go tell Sibby yourself? I'm not exactly comfortable around guards or jails. Definitely not when associates of mine have been locked up. No, I'll meet you outside of town. I'll meet you outside of town. Alright then. Who are you? Yeah. What's your problem? So, will you tell me your real name? Look, I don't really know you. I don't even really know anyone here. Why do you care anyway? It's not like we're family. This is a business. Something had to make you this angry. Look, you want to know about me? Alright, I'll tell you. I'll tell you about the time I was a young girl, barely out of her teens, living on a pig farm in the middle of nowhere. Didn't have a coin to spend between our entire family. Ate the same slot we fed our livestock. Nice. Sounds horrible. Oh wait, it gets much better. How about the fact that our farm was attacked by bandits, and that they killed my entire family who didn't even brandish a weapon against them? Here's the best part. They took me as a prize and violated me for a fortnight. Toss me from bandit to bandit like... Oh, was like, that about Fortnite? <laughs> you don't have to continue. It's fine. I had to tell someone, I suppose. Carrying around a weight like that, it hurts after a while. Cuts you inside like a dagger to the heart. How did you escape? Over time, I managed to gain their confidence. Then one night I grabbed a knife, waited until they fell asleep, and cut their throats. I never returned to that pig farm anymore. There's nothing for me there. So that's my sad story. What do you think? You still never told me your real name. Maybe one day. Just not today. I hope we bump into each other again. Alright, so, oh, she, so she likes me, okay. Right, um... Speak to Sibby Blackbriar. I your passing, friend. I think I'm going to take some followers with me, so I think this guy can be a follower. Divine smile on you, friend. Follow me, I need your help. Lead the way. I think this guy could be a follower. 
My skill in battle is unmatched. Fortunately for you, that skill can be bought. Shut up, consider yourself hired, 500 gold. With a master of magic at your side, you'll have nothing to fear. Oh my god, I think I can hire you, right? Yes, Sauron? Follow me, I need your help. Let's not waste any time. Can you follow me? Yes. Maybe not. If your allegiance lies with the Empire, we haven't much to discuss. Uh, why all the hatred for the Empire? They mean to take our history and crush it all in the name of some damn treaty. The soil beneath our feet is steeped in the blood of our ancestors. We've fought for this land and died for it. I lost my own daughter to the Imperial dogs. And by Talos, I'll not lose anyone else. What happened to your daughter? Lelia joined the Stormcloaks many years ago. When the first of the skirmishes broke out across Skyrim, I was so proud of her. She served as a battle maiden, using her healing arts to help those that fell on the battlefield. Never even lifted a blade in her life. It didn't matter. The Imperial soldiers cut her down, killed her like a dog, and left her body to rot in the mud. And that's why I won't rest easy until every single Imperial soldier joins her and Ulfric sits upon the throne of Skyrim. Support Ulfric or die trying. There's nothing in between. All right. Mm -hmm. You have some nerve coming back here after what you did to Kirava. Sure. Right, let's go speak to Sivy yeah. Blackbriar. I'm going to say because I'm not sure if this game is going to crash lugging around all these followers. Alright guys, I'm a bit of a retarder. <laughs> Went outside of the city thinking, out to Dragon, let's go inside quick. Yeah, I, let's go into the Riften Jail, where he is. Yeah, I thought he was in a jail in some other hold. No, it's actually just here, which makes it easy. So, glad. We didn't have to fast travel to another city or that probably would have crashed my game. Anyway, let's get some information of this from this guy. Hey, you're not supposed to be down here. Official business only. It's fine. I'm allowed to be here. Oh, my mistake then. Sorry, you can go on ahead. Wow, it was that easy? Okay then, let's find Sibby. CB Black, bro. Codlek White Main is a better place now. Or is there any place better than Sovereign Guard? Until next time. Have you come to gawk at me or is this a social call? Um, why are you in jail? Look. We all have our flaws. Mine is that women can't get enough of me. So I had this little affair going on while I was betrothed to a beautiful girl named Spitty. Well, she finds out and she tells her brother Wolfer that her brother attacks me with a knife. I mean, I had to defend myself. So you got arrested for his murder? Exactly. Now I have to stare at these bars for eight months. Can you believe it? I was about to let that wench marry into the richest family in Ripton. And this is how she repays me. It looks like he's got quite a nice setup in there. Look how nice it looks in here. All I need to know is where she is. I'll help you find her. Ah, that's the spirit. Find her and I promise you'll be well compensated. Do you have any information on Savidi? She was a young woman, buxom, long flowing black hair. She used to sing the most lovely songs to me when we were courting. Never heard a voice so beautiful. All that talent will go to waste when I'm finished with her. You're serving only eight months for murder? Yeah, 
and Mother thought I should be taught a lesson for airing the family's dirty laundry in public. I mean, I've taken care of many people for her in the past. What in oblivion did she expect me to do? Ah, well, at least I have all the comforts of home during my stay. Well, except the touch of a woman, of course. Alright guys, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next video.